opener uh, this Saturday, which uh, was nice to get underway. It's always strange. I say always. I've never had a meet before the start of school. This was the first time. It's just the way that the season fell. Next year we'll fall back on a normal, more rational um, schedule. But um, didn't know what to expect with a lot of the kids because they've been home for break. But they did a nice job. I think the kids, the kids worked hard and um, we're in a pretty good place. We're ahead of where we were a year ago. Um, and uh, I know it was nice for a lot of those kids to uh, who never been in a Panther uniform before to get out there and, uh, and kind of do their thing. So uh, on the balance, the staff and I were uh, pleased with what we saw. Um, some of the highlights, the, the throwers, um, as usual, did a, did a very nice job. Kelsey Sukavati and, and Sydney Raybon um, both did well in the, in the shot and the weight. Sydney PR in both events. Uh, Jordan Williams and Adam McDonald uh, did a very nice job in the, in the weight. And then uh, Jordan Williams and, and Justin Baker also did a, a really terrific job uh, in the shot put. Um, in the jumps, we have a, a newcomer who's, we're not going to have him for long, but um, he's, he's a great kid. He's in his final year of, of track. His name's Ethan Miller, and you're going to be hearing a lot about him. He, uh, he was a Division III, three, three-time national champion and uh, two-time athlete of the year. Um, he's going to be a terrific multi-source, but he's also a great jumper. And he, So he had a good long jump. Uh, he had a good hurdles race, uh, PR in that event, um, and so we're excited about him. But Charles Brown, who's, who's a freshman uh, football track guy, he continues to, to impress us, and he had, he had a nice uh, long jump as well. Um, in the high jump, Tommy Larson, um, he's uh, no surprise. He's doing a good job. He, he, he's, we thought we had high expect expectations for him, and, and he also did well. And all the vaulters across the board, uh, Jenny, Libby, Charles, uh, and uh, Corey Zamlewski, they all looked good. In, uh, did what, what we needed him to do. Um, the sprints, uh, Derek Kramer, our all-conference 60-meter runner, uh, won fairly easily, and he did he did a nice job uh, in that event. Jordan Gusky, uh, probably for me, I thought that that he was probably the most impressive kid on the day for us. Um, he's a sophomore now, and uh, he's done everything right. I mean, he's, he's great in the classroom. He, he has a great work ethic, and I think we're going to see some really good things out of him. He, he won the 300 meters and a third fastest time in the school's history, and uh, was, was terrific again uh, in the 4x4. Maddie Beeler, she's a freshman for us, and uh, we're excited about her. She's got a great attitude, and she's really developed you know, from a small school um, in Iowa, and she's, she's just worked her, her tail off, and, and she uh, was really impressive in the 4x4 in the and also the 600 meters. Sebastian Barth, he's our sophomore hurdler. He won uh, in, a, in a very good time. Technically, he's made a lot of improvements that are going to allow him to run cleaner races this year and, uh, and hopefully do some great things at the, at the conference meet. We had a new event um, that's only the second time uh, it's ever been held on U.S. soil in the 400 hurdles indoors. Um, and that was, it sounds crazy, but it actually went off without a hitch. It, everybody did well, and it, it was a fun, exciting event. Uh, the Panthers won, uh, Ryan Newtoff won for the men, and Emily Roberts won for the women, and they, they did a terrific job. It's nice to have the 400 hurdlers have an indoor event that, that they can also be excited about. They're always kind of lost during the indoor season. Uh, as far as the distance runners go, Ryan Krogman in the 1,000 meters looked very strong, and uh, Scotty Schoen uh, was impressive in the mile. Um, but like I said, it's the first meet out. It's very, very early in the season. The, the, the early January meets are a mixed bag. Some of the kids are, are more prepared than others, and uh, you never quite know what you're going to get. But uh, our kids that, that we need to be good uh, by the conference championships all looked fine, uh, and some of the newcomers impressed us. So. We're, we're cautiously optimistic as usual going forward, but I didn't come away feeling bad about the meet, and I always feel like that's a pretty good gauge about how well it went for us. Next week, uh, we're heading to the University of Wisconsin for, for uh, a good event. We haven't gone there before. This is the first meet for us uh, up in that facility, but uh, I expect that they'll put on a, a nice show for us, and, and the kids will have a real positive experience. In two weeks, we'll be coming back for the Jack Jennett invite. Jack, who's sitting right there, comes to all these events. Uh, Excited to have his name attached to that, that terrific event. Uh, we expect that to be a very good event for us. So are there any questions? Okay, thanks, and go Panthers.